Well, 420 is the only protest in the city that covers any of the costs of the event time. We cover all the costs for everything to do with this event. The park board and the city are out nothing. We just don't pay for the cops. And if they wanted to send a lot less cops, that would really be fine with us. But what we do want to do is get back to our community. So not only do we work to keep this park safe and spend a lot of money making sure this event is a safe, responsible protest, but this year we're able to give over $12,000 back to charity. So we got the CKW Kids Fund, the Overdose Prevention Society, Variety Children's Charity, these checks are getting blown all around, but $4,200 each. Last year we gave out two checks, $4,200 to the Firefighters uh, Snacks for Kids program and to the uh, St. Paul's Hospital Foundation. Hopefully next year we can give out even more. This is just sort of an estimate. If at the end of the event we have some extra money left over, we will announce more charitable donations at that point. Behind the scenes of 420 Cannabis Conference event. special guests. I got some artists from New York in town. We just got back on the road from Kelowna, sold out show. So I'm gonna smoke a little bit for five minutes and turn up. The DJ can play some music. We gonna fucking turn up Van City. Yeah. Hold, hold up, hold up. When I say heat, y'all say wave. Heat. Wave. Heat. Wave. Oh, they ready. Let's get it. Yeah. Coming up in about 10 minutes. So stick around for that. Now I gotta point out that this uh, whole affair here today is thanks to a great long list of sponsors we've got. So I want to start shouting them out for you, and you go look for them out there in the crowd and support them when you leave here today. Crop King Seeds kick down large today. They are our main huge sponsor and are doing wonderful things out there in the world, helping a lot of festivals and people get things going. Crop King Seeds, SunWest Genetics, Sonoma Seeds, Grow Real, Cannabis Life Network, which is doing a live broadcast on POT TV, Facebook, you can watch it there everywhere. Expert Joints Kicked Down, the Medicinal Cannabis Dispensary, Beard Brothers as always, Smoker's Guide, OCB, you know these names, Crack Resin, look for them out there in the marketplace and support these people. Weeds, glass, and gifts. Don and Carol are champions in our cause and are hard working, brave people. We thank them every year. Empire kicking down lots. Cush Oil. High score down on Hastings and Heatley, where you can uh, play video games and smoke weed. Night Shift Entertainment. Don't forget to support them. And we could not have done any of this without them. So uh, thanks, thanks, thanks. Our sponsors help pay for everything at this event. There's been a lot of Canada's West Coast and you clue it and saw that there was this great deforestation happening and half those trees were going for pulp. And when I learned that one acre of hemp could produce as much paper as four acres of trees over the same 20 year period and create jobs and do it environmentally friendly, man, I started becoming a hemp activist and I formed a group, Patriotic Canadians for Hemp. 
Met a lot of the pioneers in those early days, 89, early 90s. And, uh, and then I found out about all the wonderful uses of this plant, the nutritious hemp seed, which is the highest source of essential fatty acids and the most digestible protein. Hemp cloth, like I'm wearing right now, here before you, which can replace soil depleting cotton. Cotton turns dirt into a desert, man. It rips all the nutrients out of the soil and cannabis re-nourishes it. You know, and it's a wonderful, wonderful plant. We take a look at the medicines, you know, and it's like, people have always known this. It's nothing new. We're just rediscovering it, man. They knew about cannabis for epilepsy in ancient Assyria, where it was used to treat hand of ghosts, which was thought to be like a demonic possession, because that's what epilepsy was thought to be up until medieval times. And there are references to its use for that from the alchemist Paracelsus treating people with cannabis for epilepsy in the 16th century. Some even say that Jesus healed with a holy cannabosum, holy oil. When I say PC, y'all say crush! PC, crush! PC, crush! Two pots in my kitchen, uh-huh. Hundred packs in my vision, uh-huh. Money can't see your winning, uh-huh. Dripping in my dresses, yeah, uh-huh. Hold up, DJ, hold up. Y'all know what's up, man. How the fuck y'all doing? Y'all know what's up, man. I want to get back on stage though one time. How y'all doing today, Vancouver? Let's get it, next one. Come to the top. 